Hi, it's Stu from Cellar Masters here. The question is often asked of me, where have all the corks gone? Why are we now closing or stopping bottles of wine with these things, screw caps? The issue lies in the actual precursor to this, the cork. Cork was the perfect closure for wine for absolutely centuries, and in the, in the minds of a lot of winemakers, still is. Because I've got to be very honest with you, the jury is still out on what, what is actually a better closure for wine to keep its primary characters in, in place. Is it the Stelvin? Is it the screw cap, basically, or is it the cork? Then basically the cork, which is the actual outside bark of the cork tree, started to actually get basically what's called um, chemical compounds put into it to actually make it grow faster. And the main one is TCA. And as a result, we can actually put a TCA um, cork inside a bottle of wine. It can make that wine basically dull, flabby, and taste really quite ordinary. And all the major primary fruit characters of that wine are completely dissipated. The actual drive to actually change from cork to screw cap was actually instigated by makers of premium Riesling within Australia quite a few decades ago, or a few decades ago. And that's great that it came from the premium level down because they said, okay, no more cork. We're sick and tired of up to 10% in some cases of our wine being ruined by a cork. And the Riesling is a style of wine, a variety of wine that relies on its aromas. It is an aromatic wine. When you lose the primary fruit characters, you lose the wine. So basically, the revolution started with the Riesling maker and it has now filtered down through all other styles of, make, uh, of wine make in Australia to the point now whereby there are still the traditional makers who still believe that the cork is the better closure because it allows infinitesimal slow oxidisation over a long period of time, which actually benefits the actual uh, development of the wine in the bottle. So the really premium upmarket reds in Australia particularly still use the very finest cork available in the world to actually stop there and close their wine. But you, you actually see that the revolution has meant that the vast majority of wines now and uh, a majority of reds now close under this screw cap. It keeps the flavour absolutely primary, absolutely vital uh, and as fresh as a daisy exactly as the winemaker intended. So. Cheers.